time to start Data Live Season 2 reactions. A couple of you guys have been asking me, have I stopped doing Data Live reactions? Are you going to continue with this series? Can you at least finish till Season 4? Like, bro, you think I have any intentions of dropping this series? If you look at the viewership, the number of views I get on this series versus other shit, this Data Live blows everything out the water. This series is the only thing saving my channel from tanking right now. I am struggling, man. Also, it helps that I'm enjoying the show a lot. I have no plans to drop, but we're going to continue all the way as long as you guys are interested. Let's begin today's reaction. This is the first space click that ever happened. 150 million death, I think. Dude, I love the soundtrack. This is the first soundtrack we ever heard in Data Live, like season one, episode one. It's so good. Who could be this girl? I am so interested in who the girl responsible for this space quake is. Is Kotori gonna be? Nah. You know, in season one. Jesus. No, no. She was on top of us, flashing her panties. Oh, that's the spirit dorm. Toka, did you do something? Did you put a spoon in the microwave? I spilled my drink on the note you gave me. That's not the explosion, though. Oh. Toka, no! Oh. It's her going, like, berserk mentally. Causing that explosion? Was that like a tiny mini space quick thing? Yoshino, what? What? Oh, no. This isn't the bathroom, is it? Don't. Relax, relax. What? <laughs> Yoshino always just gets dropped, or like we lose it. <laughs> How did Yoshino even get down there? Ah, it's freezing. I want Shido to put Yoshino on and start Yoshino to start talking. Oh, is this AST? Because she took the. Whoa, whoa. New characters? Where's, this guy seems kind of like important, right? Two months. She's gonna go rogue, isn't she? I didn't know Origami had like these friends. I don't think I've ever met them. D More acronyms! D-E-M. A-S-T. I, I, I forget all the other ones. But they're from the D-E-M. Judging by what he's saying there... I think he's one of the most important key players that's like basically running this entire thing, brainwashing all the girls to make sure that it's I have to give up my life to beat the spirits kind of deal. So he's probably a bad guy. Ooh, the Yegi. Oh, oh yeah. That's that's the best, dude. Meat. Oh. No, 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 you, you don't. You don't. Even Yoshinon's enjoying the toast. Yoshinon, eat! I want to see you eat, Yoshinon. Favorite show? The news? This is probably kind of important. Wait, okay. Housewives, what? What is this shit? There into this drama? This is Yoshino's favorite show? What? No, show me more! I'm kinda interested. <laughs> You're not being very discreet. What are you doing? No shit, we found you! <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> She's not even trying to be funny. But it's so funny. Did you bring us to a bathroom stall? This is your idea? Uh, somewhere private? No, you don't have to take <laughs> I gotta take a shit right now. What do you mean? I've been holding this shit in since the OVA. You told me not to go. Last month, when you showed up at the park and shot it all up. Ridiculous. Do you? Really? I, I, I mean, that wasn't the case in the finale, but okay. Reformed origami? Yeah, you did. And us. Bro, she shot missiles at her back. It, you did kill us! You sniped <laughs> us and Breadkun! But you gotta pass, because you're so goddamn freaky, Origami. I love that shit about you. <laughs> hmm? I gotta take a shit. What? That's a very good question. Like, why does he have the power to seal people away? How can he seal the powers inside? How does this anything make sense? <laughs> He only wants the head pads. 
From the drama? Are you actually gonna misunderstand from this? Man, she figures out that we're with Origami right now. She'd blow up for sure. Yo, she knows it's so serious. She fucking zoned in. Toka, no! This isn't Shiro. Toka, no! Jamming signal. Yeah, Origami tech. Something more advanced. Okay, this is again, they mentioned in the previous episode when we went over to her house, her jamming tech is more advanced than the, like the HQ itself. They just referred to it again. What's going on with Origami? Like, what? Oh, I just realized. This is a new soundtrack. This is pretty good too. I don't think he is. He's got to be some special being too. I mean, he of course is a special being, but like what? That won't happen until the memories come back more. Uh, hello? What, you want to hang out? I must obtain beverages for the school trip. <laughs> she has some way with words, man. Ah. Fuck! Am I actually falling for Origa? Ah, shit. I have slowly been liking Origami a lot more. Oh, no. Poor Toka, man. She's gonna find out. No, 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 no! No! Origami, don't! Is she gonna show up from behind? Yes. We have to take a shit. No. no. Origami, don't show up. Origami, don't. No! Why? Why? Why are you here? We're in a private scene. I don't... <laughs> no! <laughs> Toka just keeps taking L's! No, we would never! She's gonna, she's gonna say yes. Fucking origami, man. Fucking origami, man. She's just so quick with them. This is getting up from the TV drama now. <laughs> Jesus! So get more. I don't think this has actually happened in season one, or at least seen like visual cues like that of whenever she like loses it mentally and like things are just like blowing up. No! No, you you are number one girl. The repeated transfer widened the path between... This seems like an important mechanic. Repeated transfer of powers... Path with... What? Oh, it's the two girls from uh, Origami's friends. Like, I don't remember them in season one, but I think they're getting introduced now, I guess. And they're going to be like more like important AST side characters, along with the captain. Also, why? Why is this entire AST operation just run by girls? Except the higher ups, which is just old dudes. Like, this entire crew is just all girls. Like, like our, our place makes kind of sense. It's very diverse, right? AST is just all pretty much like 12 year old girls. Then again, our commander is, is like a 13-year-old girl. <laughs> oh. That, that, oh, wait! This is technically not canon episode, but they're mentioning it here like that. Maybe it is canon then, I don't know. A bit? Come on, spend the whole day with her. No, you were just jumping to those conclusions after watching that TV show. That is ridiculous. Toka could literally have a dream of Shido cheating on her, and then she'll get upset. It's like, what the fuck did we do?! Her, your, your ribbons. <laughs> the ribbon. <laughs> no poker face at all. Give her a head pat, it's over. No. <gasps> oh no, oh no! It's, it's okay, we, we, there's many different breads. Is that her favorite? Soy flour bread? Oh no. I've never had soy flour bread. I use the bread that I like is like the anpan, which is like um, red bean bread. There's like red bean paste in the bread. It's so good if you know what I'm talking about. Hello, Yoshino one, Yoshino one. Did we get her oyakudon though? Do we? Do we? Okay, thank God, thank God. I didn't see him get it up, you know. 
Wait, get it up? What am I talking about? Oh, no. No, no, no. This is going to be a repeat. This is going to be a repeat. Don't say that in front of her! This is the exact same scene of leaving with the fucking, you know, the luggage. She's gonna... She looks cute. She looks cute. That's what Origami said! The soy? Imagine he says soy flour bread. Could you imagine? Stop watching the show! Stop watching the show! It's predicting the future! <laughs> no! That's a, that's a different dude in the TV show! Oh no, this is gonna be with Origami right there. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh no, stop it! Is this the place where we got sniped? Yeah. Oh shit. Damn! Her astral dress is out. This is our place. To the luggage? It's not that big a deal. No. We're not going anywhere! <laughs> Toka! Thunderphone! Oh shit. <laughs> what are you gonna do? You gonna... Yo, Thunderphone scabbard kind of looks like a throne too, like a chair. Toka, you're being unreasonable. No, no, no! You're watching too much of that TV drama show. It's for clothes. No, we're trying to get it fixed. Goodbye forever, boss. <laughs> that never happened! We didn't have the fucking trench coat! No, baby girl, now drop that sword, it's intimidating! Does Sandalfon get a lot smaller? Or is this because her powers obviously isn't all back to her? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, what? She didn't mean to do that. She lost control? Interesting. Can we get it back? Annihilate both Toka and this. It would annihilate Toka? How? Like she can't contain the energy anymore? Jesus. This is kind of reminding me of the scene where uh, we were walking towards the blizzard trying to get to Yoshino. What's going on with Toka's powers? Is this due to the result of the widening of the path? Like she has no control anymore? I don't even know what a path is! Give you a head pat! This is when Shido was so good. Moments like this is when he's such a good main character. But then outside of this, he does some dumb shit. <laughs> and Toka always takes the L's because of it. Oh. Catch him! This is kind of like... Remember? Yeah, and then we had a kiss! It was in there! Toka caught, you know, Shino in that episode too, and Origami sniped them! Wait, what's going on? Okay, sealed again. I don't know how they can just float down like this when the powers are sealed, but we don't have to worry about that detail. <laughs> the path is stable. What is a path, man? The path between Shido and Toka? Transfer of powers happens through that path? It's some kind of abstract passage that can transfer energy? Yeah. Oh no, stop watching. No, just stop watching. Oh. Oh, is this from the TV show? They got... <gasps> it's the guy from the DEM. This guy is probably some like, super important like endgame stuff, right? I don't know. But this is one of the higher ups we're finally seeing from like the AST side, even though it's called DEM, right? Yeah, you didn't show up once in season one. Let's see what you guys can do. Ellen. The greatest wizard in history. Because wizards are basically... Origami is also a young wizard. It's whoever uses that like human-created magic, right? That can compete with spiritual magic, right? The greatest wizard ever, though? Damn. Wait, they have their own spacecraft, too, just like us. Kurumi, what are you up to? Damn. That's smooth jazz, man. Oh, so good. Us? Is she breaking the fourth wall right now? Us? You, you talking to us? So that she can use her angel again, right? But... So cool that she has to shoot herself for the powers. 
You would pet in Zafkyo's final ball. What? But she's definitely talking about Shido, right? You come back to us! You haven't been around since like episode 10 or something. The first spirit! 150 mil! Who's the. So they're alive? These origin spirits still alive? This is some important bloodshed. Even though it seemed like a joke of, you know, Toka watching the TV show and then getting upset and, you know, jumping to conclusions, that was actually really important for us to understand more about the space quake, the transfer of power. If it happens too much, the path widens. This path is probably, you know, the connection between Shiro and the different spirits that allows him to seal and also, I don't know, the transfer of power, right? I, I, and then the space quakes also, we saw more visual cues of if she actually starts to mentally lose it, it actually stuff start, like, starts breaking out. And even her, at, like, when she started to use those purple waves just came out without her control, she, she does really just lose control if she's that mentally unstable. Or is that because they've been transferring powers too much? I don't really know. The guy from the DEM, that sounds like super important stuff too. Ellen, the greatest wizard mage the greatest wizard alive she did she have white hair didn't did you imagine if it's like origami's mom or something I, I don't really know but this is implying that she is some next level that can probably fight the spirits along with mana but do you remember how mana doesn't have that much like lifespan because of the tech that she's using i would imagine that ellen is also the same thing but she looks a little bit older interesting to see what's going on we're getting more and more you know answers about this show but this, this answers are sprinkled in and every time we get like an answer like 13 different questions more pop up but it's really like this kind of mystery is super important kurumi's final bullet yod beth she needs more time. You remember her her angel like it consumes so much mana, and that's why Shido is so important, right? He probably I don't know. He's probably like, like an infinite source of magical powers, isn't Shido or something? And that's what Kudumi is probably after. Getting pretty interesting. We got a school trip coming up, so that'll be the next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care. <laughs>